Welcome to another edition of Smart Chat in NBA starting right now and just kind of my quick thoughts on the 2016-2017 Chicago Bulls. Kind of like my preview I guess for lack of a better word or like things to look at. Jimmy Butler and Dwayne Wade, that combination is going to be interesting. Wade, he worked well with LeBron. And is certainly a team first player in Wade. Butler, though, I think he lacks the uh, the court vision and overall game impact that James does at this point. No one compares to LeBron James. So I'm very interested in seeing the dynamic between Butler and Wade. Rondo, who you guys got there too, always an interesting case. Will he implode? Will he get along with the coach? It seems like he never really found a coach that he likes. Will there be fireworks with Rondo and the coach? I wouldn't be surprised. This move that they made and they got rid of Derrick Rhodes. And, and just like the Knicks, this could either work out nicely or it could just blow up in the, the head coach of Chicago's face. Um, this, without question, when you look at the central division there where the Bulls are, it will be... The toughest in their Eastern Conference. Cavaliers, you figure that they're going to win the Central. The Pacers, I think, will be right behind them. Right behind them, I think that's where the Chicago Bulls will be. You know, they have a nice supporting cast in the Bulls. Um, Bobby Portis... Doug McDermott, Tony Snell, all productive pieces. Key too, besides the, dy the dynamic between Butler and Wade, is if Wade could actually stay healthy. When you look at the Bull Bulls team, you just have kind of, I'm a little bit, perturbed as to how all these pieces will fit. You know, at the end of the day, I really don't think that 